Maybe every time you're up here, I'm afraid I'm gonna run over you. <laughs> oh. Jeff and I are getting to work on the roof rack, and uh, it's starting to get dark out. I'm gonna try to record whatever we do today, but it's gonna be difficult with the low light. Parker up because he was at cousin's house and but now he's with us. Got my new rims. This is all like new stuff to me. I've never done any kind of welding, fabricating, slicing, like even cutting metal was like foreign to me because my dad would never let me play with power tools. I remember the first time my dad let me cut something, I was like, you actually trust me enough to cut something out of metal? Hey Willy, don't pee on my Jeep again, that's just gross. Look at that. Solid. Man, you knocked a lot out fast. Yeah. <laughs> so much for filming the process, that's so I cool. Know, though. Sorry. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> I'd rather have it done. I then. found the window that like it was nice and cool last night and I was like just kept going. Yeah, that's so cool. Um, but right now what we're trying to do is trying to strengthen up this roof rack. So this is a Smitty Belt roof rack. It's like a $300 rack and it's not known for being the most sturdy rack. So we're going to try to do what I think will help make it stronger, make it be able to hold up, dealing with all the same stuff that a usual like Garvin would deal with, but for the budget price. We'll see if this works. If it doesn't, you know, we'll go back, brainstorm new ideas, but I'm pretty confident this is going to work. Mama. Got a feeling that I'm onto something. Wings growing on my back, and the best that I feel when I think back and I check myself.
a little bit of brainstorming, Jeff and I decided that the best way to strengthen the rack was to add these brackets running from the rack to the tub. I hadn't considered this, but Jeff came up with an idea to actually use the existing holes behind the tail lights and just bolt those right on. The end product was this, a strong heavy duty budget rack. And on top of that, Jeff actually came up with the idea to build a ladder onto the rack. That way I'll have easy access to get on top of the roof. Huge thank you to Jeff for helping me make this rack. Putting our brains together, we're able to come up with the design. He did all the heavy lifting. I think it turned out amazing. I had a little bit of trouble filming right now because it's raining, I need to run inside, so sorry for the water spec right here. That bracket we made, it doesn't require any drilling. We welded it on, but after we were done, we were talking about it. We might see about maybe selling those, just you know, make, having a little cutout, making it so you guys can buy that if you buy this rack and be able to make your rack more sturdy for more abusive work. If that's something that might interest you, um, please um, comment down below and tell us if you'd be interested in buying that, if you made some of those, see if maybe we can work something out you know, and see if, I don't know, it might be pretty cool. It was really easy for us because um, Jeff does fab work, but I know a lot of people don't have access to getting that done. So if you are interested in buying that as a product, let me know and I'll reach out to him, see if we can figure something out. Mama, I've got a feeling that I'm onto something. Wings growing on my back. Out.